Hi everybody, it's me, made by Marsha Mom, Marsha. Wet hair, don't care, I have to work today. Um, how's everybody, how's everybody doing? Um, here I go with the ums again. And the bad lighting because the sun is coming through that window. Anyways, I just want to get on and make a quick video because it's been like, I don't even know. Um, June 9th, I think. <laughs> Not sure. Um, anyways, um, so I decided to get on today because this is my, uh, my C word hair because I am not had time to get anything done, but it's wet. So, cause I have to work today as usual. I'm back at my other store. Long story short. Um, I beg to go back. So there I am. Anyway, excuse the mess, because the whole room is mess. I can't get a good angle, and uh, you don't even want to see over there. So, <laughs> anyways, what have I been up to? Um, I just rewatched my old video to see what I had shown you, what I hadn't shown you. So, uh, yeah, here I am. I finally finished. Hang on, I'm digging out of the box, because, uh, yeah, even though I promise things, I always forget to mail them, even on my day off. And uh, so... I was telling you in my last video that um, I needed to, I don't even know if I get these all on camera, I needed to um, cut apart some receiving blankets, of which I noticed I made some of these for her originally, so this is like um, restitching something I already did for her. Um, anyways, so I took receiving blankets. And I forgot how many receiving blankets there were, but I finally made the, um, my daughter likes to cloth diaper, but I made, I'm not even going to show you these individually. I'll show them to you this way. This is what I got to, she can have got those wispies off from the serger, but this is what a hundred and hundred and something washcloths look like made from flannel. So some people call them, uh, family family cloths but she like I said she uses them for diapering and it's a great way to recycle there are um nine by nine by seven I think and then after I finished all these I was upset because I only had 99 and then I recounted and I had a hundred so but then I took the scraps and made some smaller ones which aren't up to par so I have over a hundred and then uh I was cleaning up my craft room excuse me coffee and I noticed over there, I missed a receiving blanket. <laughs> so she'll have, I don't know. I probably won't wait for that. And then here's just books that are in the box that we bought for Emmett. This is a cool book. Who flung dung? <laughs> That's for Emmett. And I love you like no otter. And dinosaur dinosaurs. That was good night. Eventually, those will go to you, Emmett and Lucas. I have the box packed up, but will I mail it soon? I don't know. Um, and then what else? I did start an elephant. I don't know where I put it. Um, somebody commissioned an elephant, but like I said, my hands have been hurting. So it's, uh, crochet is not the thing right now, but I did manage on all my eight days off in between. I managed to make some more cards. Um, I guess I'll start with these. Oh, is that a bad angle? I don't know. I made a happy birthday. Oh, yeah, I got to talk about the other new thing in the room. Um, another happy birthday. Hey, hey, puppies. Another happy birthday. I think that's happy birthday. Yep, that's a happy birthday, too. And more. And another one. And a just because. Another just because. Can you tell I got new dyes? <laughs> another just because. And what a beautiful difference a single life makes. Using up. Ah, but wait, there's more. And last night I was playing because I got new um, alcohol markers. 
so I colored and cut and stamped just a little note see the cute little butterfly he's so cute um matching envelope and there's a ton of cards here if you follow me on Facebook you already saw some of these but this one says my heart is grateful for you so a fall card new dies this one same kind of deal but in copper <laughs> daisies and a basic hello I don't know if you can see the shimmer on there but as much as I was impressed with um, Wink of Stella I have a new product they have there these and you put them in a spritzer bottle mm -hmm. they're uh what are they called frost white and champagne mm -hmm. they add either like a snow lake thing or glitter and they're not as messy as glitter sorry and new dyes that one says hello and i embossed it see little flowers and another one just wanted to say hello I got a new white pen, so I made the little dots. Can you see them? They're very cute. And then I made a namaste. And let's see. Those are all the, um, oh, wait. And I'm in the middle of, can't decide, but these are the pieces so far that I want to put together. And I had to go to bed last night. So, then, I've been working on, lost my train of thought, <laughs> typical for me, because you can never be too early, <laughs> I'm making Christmas cards, it says Happy Holidays, now that's got the, I think that's the Wink of Stella, it could be the Shimmer Paint, I can't remember, and then... A lot of these are the same, but I mean, they're a teeny bit different because I was playing, but see all this shimmer and another one. Whoops. That one goes that way. And I did a bunch of things with the envelope. So another one, I've got new stamp and dies. Can you tell? Like I've already said, and another one. Last year I had snowman, snowman themed and I put little snowflakes in them. I wonder what I'm going to put in my cards this year. And that one I did some, uh, what do you call it? Um, not embossing. Gosh darn it. Carrie, you know what I want. You know what I mean. So this one's got gold in it too. And on the flowers. And I went carried away with the little glitter paint. Here's one a little more subdued but i still did the um gosh what do you call that when you use a little gold oh embossing powder <laughs> here's another one then i got into my oh she'll probably if she watches because she's the only one that i know i think this one's a happy Hanukkah card and it's purple. So let's see if she can guess who it's for. Got a lot of bling and shiny on it. And then this one, I did white emboss on the snowflake, but you can tell I like purple. And I made, these are all kind of the same, sort of. They all have matching envelopes too, but I made that one a little the little um, sequiny things on there sparkling and then I made that one and this one different colors but still shimmery and then that one so that's about sums up all my days off in between my last video and now. Maybe. Oh, and I, I did some coloring with the um, Stampin' Blends. And I just got a ton, like a ton of new stamps. Like, I'm getting overwhelmed. Because I haven't even used them all. And then I 
always more that I want because even though I said this catalog, oh, I don't know. Oh, that's an envelope that I messed up on. But see, all these tabs, that's what I own in this catalog. <laughs> and then, which I still owe Carrie a copy, but I'm horrible about mailing, like I said. Then they came out with their holiday, well, they call it their. I don't know. I forgot what they're calling it now. But with all the um, holiday stuff, there's Halloween stuff in here. And all these tabs are what I own. And I don't even know if that's updated. Because when you buy so much, back in, um, what was it? Let's see, it's August now. So in July, for every $50 you spent, you got a $5 off coupon. So essentially, I got a bunch of stuff for free because I spent so much money. And boy, I look like crud today, but sorry, wet hair, don't care. Um, and then I've been playing like with um, stamping out butterflies and coloring. I made a giraffe. Um, the piggy, I don't like the wings, the color of the, um, and these were not the Stampin' Plins. These were, I bought some uh, cheapo alcohol markers off of um, Amazon and yeah, now I know why they're only $29, because they kind of suck. And then, what else has been new? Um, Like, I've got, like, a ton of new dies. And my whole, if you could see this mess, it's a mess. The other thing we got new, let me see if I can get them to come here. Hang on. Come here, Smoka. Come here, Smoke. Come here. Smoke, come here. He won't come. Because I have a new grand pup. And he's in here. Come here, Smoke. You won't come? Come here. You want some? Come here. He's like being lazy. And I would show you, but my floor is like a <laughs> mess. Um, let me see if I can grab him. So, excuse the mess. Behind. Oh, well, Bear Bear will come up. Come here. Come on. Bear Bear will come up. Because he always does. There's my Bear Bear. Oh, yes. They had bass the other day. Oh, he's got his leg going. That's my bar bar. And he's very jealous of the new puppy. Yes. Okay, you get down? Will you get down? No? All right. Let me let me show Smoka. They've already seen you. Can I get Smoka? Just a minute. Come here, Smoka. Come here. Come here. Oh. Oh. All right. This is my new grand puppy. So he's been keeping me busy too. We look at the camera. Well, you look at the camera, look how cute he is. His eyes were really stony blue, but high smoke. That's our new baby. Oh, there he goes. All right. I'm going to put you back down because you're getting heavy. He was so tiny. It was a sad story when I was working at the other store. Come on, baby. Come on. I was working at the other store that's like an hour away, which I didn't want to work at. But long story short, some guy came in and... um. He uh, had three puppies in his car, and I went, oh, my gosh, they're so cute. And I saw Smoke, and he was the only one that looked like him. And Bear Bear, <laughs> you're being obnoxious. Anyways, he was the only one that looked like him. So I sent a picture to my daughter, and I said, do I dare? Because the sad story was his mama got hit by a car the night before, and they were just barely off their mommy for eating. And I guess he's a breeder of... Um, the pits. Oh, don't do that smoke. Hang on. Smoke's getting into my heat gun. Um, and he didn't know what to do with the puppy. So I sent Ashley a picture. I said, you got 30 minutes to get up here <laughs> or I'm giving him back. So now we have three dogs and it's like having a new baby. And he's normally locked up when I have, when I'm in my craft room because he tends to eat everything. <laughs> anyway, so, uh, yeah, update um, on what else? On uh, my medication. I um, I won't spend too much time. Maybe I'll rent. I might. Yeah, I look really bad. Anyway, so I, <laughs> I called my old doctor, the doctor that I had before, that I wasn't sure if he took my new insurance because they moved and they built a new building and they were kind of expensive. And long story short, um, well, long story long because you know me and nothing's ever short with me. Um, I happened to call them up because I was still fighting with the other doctor or nurse. 
And uh, I called them up and said, hey, uh, can I refill my thyroid meds? Oh, sure. Do you want anything else? <laughs> like, okay, refill all my meds. And uh, sure enough, they refilled everything. So, uh, yeah, I went back to my old doctor, um, which, which is a new doctor because my old doctor's not even there anymore. And, oh, got a notification. Um, my old doctor doesn't even work there anymore. So, um, my old, old doctor. So, yeah, my meds are fine. Um, they have tested me for RA and all this other kind of stuff because of, um, my hips and my, and my shoulders and stuff and, so far, the tests are just, uh, they're fine. So that's good news, but bad news because I'm still in a lot of pain. So I don't know. Um, but I have all my meds refilled and then I have to go for the regular, you know, girly stuff. And yeah, that's, you know, me. <laughs> so anyway, so that's all fine. Um, and say, I'm trying to, I'm trying to look at the camera, but I've got the, um, window there. That's like blinding me um anyway so uh what else i'm at 16 minutes and my mess um what else i don't even know what else but yeah so i'm i'm alive and well with uh outgrown hair and um it's a hot mess and i'm working and yeah girls are back in school I know some people are against that, but, um, yeah, with all us being essential workers, I think they're about exposed as they're going to be and seeing as, you know, people are still out and about and they're doing what they want to do. Um, another notification, um, why not put them in school? I mean, I know that pff, as a former teacher, but the school, their, their classes only have 17 kids in them. So yeah, I'm probably going to start some crap on that, huh? Um, yeah, so they're back in school. Makes it easier on us. Um, and they've got all these things in place. Like, it takes like 45 minutes to pick them up from school now because they don't line them all up on this bench for parent pickup. They, um, I think they keep them in their classrooms and they call them as you show up. And so it takes a long time. Like, we showed up at, they said to come early yesterday. So we showed up at like 10 after 2. And we were in the line. And... Um, and mind you, they do bus and everything. So, and they're taking temps and all that they have. Uh, there's a lot of good things in place there. Um, but I don't think we got them until 2.45. It was ridiculous. And, uh, today is not my turn to pick them up. I actually got to do it on her lunch. So, uh, yeah, I won't be in that line because I hate lines. So, what else is new? I want to say hi to everybody. I'm not mentioning names this time because, you know, I always forget somebody that I feel bad. And, sorry, there's a glare on my glasses. But, anyway, so, I just want to let you know I'm alive and well. And, um, leave a comment down below if you watched. Um, I don't know what to say. Um, what comment do I want you to have? Um, how about, tell me your favorite color. And put that down below because now that I'm well up over 500, I don't know. I'm losing some since the giveaway, but that's, I don't care. Um, I'm at 500 at least, I think. I'm over 500. But anyways, I'm going to do a giveaway. Um, so name your favorite color. And um, I don't even care if you're a subby. Just leave a comment with your favorite color. And I will talk to you guys later.